Hello boys and girls, how are you going? In today's video, we're taking a look at the Remington 870 Tactical Geobull Shooter. So, here it is in the box. Clear plastic film, you can see the shotgun there. Got some gel balls in a container there, and a number of foam darts here. 10 foam darts. So this thing shoots not only gel balls, but also uh, foam suction cup darts, so it'll also shoot nerf darts. Claiming to reach 80 feet, safe and exciting, long distance, environmental, environmentally friendly, and durable. So let children experience the exciting game in a safe environmental condition. Um, that's just what it says there. On the back, let's have a look. Very nice picture of the shotgun here. 100% um, safe. Trigger, the handle, the grip, uh, the scope with a light. And down here, it's a cool layout. It shows you some of the features. It's got the shotgun there, and then it shows you like putting the scope on, loading that, the dart. So, let's open her up. There's also a handle on the top. Alrighty, now I don't know, you guys may have seen the M1014 gerbil shooter. That has a stock, this one doesn't have a stock on the end. But um, I'll post a link to that video in the description. My guess is that this will shoot similar to the M10, so uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. Now, taking a look at the gel balls. Uh, comes with 200 in, 200 in a container. These are probably the same size as the uh, ones that the M1014 shoots. Let's see here. So these are the 11 to 13 centimeters. So you've got the smallest one, six to seven, eight millimeter, uh, nine to 11, and then these are 11 to 13. So, I say we put a bloody dart in. Okay, so it goes in that far. Oh, damn, there's definitely no air restrictor in this. It's got a nice textured wooden grip here. Uh, as, as well as on the top, that looks quite nice. So I'll just stand up now and give you guys a better look at the blaster. Alrighty guys, so here it is. So you can see there, one to one scale. Very nice. Let's look at the other side. So to fire a foam dart, you simply push that down like that. Very nice. Do this one. There we go. Now I'm just going to pop off a couple of these. Um, I will do a range test later outside because um, shooting these indoors it can get a little bit messy. talked about when a sip gets messy. Never look down a barrel. Wow, so this one, it appears There we go, okay. Ah, there, now it's working. So the first shots, because the gun's brand new and it hasn't been used out of the box, uh, the barrel's not lubricated, it's not wet, so it's quite, it's just dry and rough, so the bullets just explode. Um, the first few bullets will just explode, but after that, the barrel becomes more lubricated and uh, it can fire them properly. Ooh. And that is packing some force. Nice. Okay, this is uh, definitely shooting better than the M10. From what I'm seeing indoors. Yeah, that's cool. All right, this is gonna be really cool when we do a range test. Well guys, hate to spoil the fun, but uh, we'll have to leave it at that today and uh, we'll get back with a range test shortly. So uh, stay tuned for that. If you have any questions, pop them down in the comment section below. Um, a very, very nice shotgun and I think this is gonna be uh, quite a bit of fun. Anyway, thanks for watching. We'll catch you in the next video.